everyone welcome back to excel vba tutorial series um hope everyone's doing well i know it's been a while again but just been caught up so um let's just get started with um our continuation of understanding how loops work so in our today's chapter we will demonstrate how can loop be useful um in several ways one of the examples that we're looking at today is that using a loop we will loop through each of these cells and we will create multiple sheets with every weekday name on it so I'm gonna start with this example without wasting any time let's just jump down to the developers tab on Visual Basic so we've got a sub over here let's start off with defining an integer and um, an object so an object is something that you can assign as a cell reference or any object that exists so for example for this object let's assign it to this workbook which is the active workbook dot sheets loop example 1.1 dot cells which is the sh sheet I've got opened right here let's say i equal to 2 so we would want to start a loop off with row number 2 so we will call is2 so let's run a do while loop so do while um, my vb which is assigned to this workbook dot sheets loop example dot cells i which is my row number 2 so the loop will start right from here dot comma 1 which is my column number 1 which is column a so columns are referred as numerically if you have to refer to a cell so this would be 1 this would be 2 3 and so on so do while my workbook i comma as in the row comma column um, the value does not equal to blank and then you would just write loop in the end so this would keep running a loop and it will keep increasing the is value which we will write right here so every time the loop runs the i will keep increasing so for example first it will be monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday sunday and then finally when this loop finds a blank value it will automatically exit the loop so we will keep looping until there's no blank value so perhaps from row 2 to row 8 so now within this loop let's say um, this workbook dot sheets dot add so in every loop we will keep adding new worksheets and then we will assign the name active worksheet dot name equal to my vbi dot one dot value so this value will basically be the cell where the loop is currently running so the first time when the loop runs it will be monday tuesday then tuesday then wednesday and so on so now if we look at running this loop what this would do is this would create multiple sheets with all these weekdays added to it so even if I had to create about 65,000 sheets um, I would probably write down 65,000 I, I would just keep increasing my list with whatever I want as new sheet names and this loop should suffice our requirements so let's just try running this loop um, so let's click on run sub okay so we've got some error here um, so to so see um, I should have referred to it in this manner okay so let's try it again so yep we finished our sub procedure and as we can see we've got multiple sheets that have been created right here Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday and Sunday so um, guys this is how basically we could um, use loops um, and um, complete task that could take a very long time if we had to do it manually so anyways guys thanks for watching and um, stay tuned for more videos and have a nice weekend take care bye bye